Hi, this is Alex from Groovy Entertainment. Today we got another record to play for you. Today record, The Cat on the Doverville for 19... Okay, no year. So let's get started. The Cat on the Doverville. Once upon a time, a man caught a great white bear while he was visiting in Denmark. And he brought it home to his family. Hey, what do you think of him, honey? Isn't he a great big bear? Oh my goodness! What can you be thinking? Well, why, I the, you'd like it. why the creature will eat us out of house and oh, home? Oh my god! Oh, he's so big, he could probably eat our whole porch and all. Well, uh, what shall I do with him then? I you don't want me to turn him loose outside, do you? Well, now, let's see. Why, you can make a present of him to the king, the king of Denmark. Of course, he always keeps bears. It impresses the tourists. So the man left with the bear to take him to the king and present him. Now, it happened that he came to the Doverfell just before Christmas Eve. And there, he knocked on the door of a man called Halvor. Good day, Halvor. They tell me you have rooms for the night. May I have one for myself and my bear? <laughs> steady, boy, steady. Well, I'd like to rent it to you. I haven't rented it to a man and his bear in some time. Wonderful company it'd be that I can't rent to anyone just now. For every Christmas Eve, you see, this, this horrible pack of trolls comes down upon us and we're forced to flee willy-nilly, scurrying away, leaving them food so that they won't chase us. Now, we usually spend Christmas out of doors, crying and shivering, bemoaning our fate. Now, you best try the Holiday Inn down the road. So the man said, Oh, that's just the problem. You can easily rent me your house. Uh, my bear can lie under the stove like a household cat, you know, and I can sleep off in a side room. Now, those trolls will be so busy gobbling and gabbing, they'll never notice us. Believe me, believe me. Well, Talbor tried to dissuade him and told him horrible stories about the trolls. But the man kept insisting, and at last, Talbor rented to him. So the people of the house left quickly. But before they went, everything was left out for the trolls. The tables were laid with the finest linen, and there was rice porridge and fish boiled in wine and sausages and much else that was good to eat, just as at any fine feast. Then, when everything was ready, down came the trolls. Some were huge, some were small, some had long tails and some had no tails at all. Some, also, had long, long noses. And they ate, and they drank, and they chewed on everything, even the linen tablecloths. Halfway through the night, one of the littlest trolls saw the white bear who lay under the stove. Hey, uh, hey, fellas, come on. It's a giant cat sleeping underneath the stove all the time. Then he took a piece of sausage stuck it on a fork and went and poked it up against the bear's nose. Wake up, pussycat! Wake up, pussycat! Want some sausage, eh? Sausage, eh? Come on, kitty! Come on, kitty! Sausage! Sausage! Then the white bear was angered. He rose up growling and chased the whole pack of them out of doors. The big trolls and the little trolls, they all ran screaming. Well, when the man woke up in the morning, see that the trolls had come and gone, leaving the room in a shambles. He gently awakened his bear, who was again sleeping under the stove. Away they went. Hit. Exactly one year later, Halvor was out in the woods on the afternoon of Christmas Eve. Got to get this wood in before those trolls come down. Oh, they'll tear the place apart again. We'll be all week cleaning up after him. Just then, he heard a voice in the woods calling out. Help me! Help me! Take it easy. Take it easy. You're overloading. Oh, Help me! Here I am. Here I am. What do you want? Well, oh, well, uh, have you got that big cat with you still? That big cat. Oh, the 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 big cat.
right now under the stove, and, and, and what's more, she has now got several kittens, far bigger and fiercer than uh, she herself could ever be. Oh, 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 since that time, the trolls have never eaten their Christmas dinner at the home of Halvor on the Dover Day. So that was the cat on the Doverville for night. Um, so, if you like, subscribe, share, and comment, and have a groovy day. We'll have another video coming out real soon.